in the shotgun. Here's the give. They'll start the runoff right away. Look at the big run. 50, 40, 30. Wow. <laughs> what a huge statement to start this ball game out for Mississippi Valley State. Caleb Johnson, we just talked about how big of a game he'll have to have. What a big run to start the game. Single setback here for Mississippi Valley. Here's a throw, and it is complete touchdown, Mississippi Valley State. What a throw, and the catch was made by Ja'Cory Rankin, the senior from Port Gibson. Daniels, quarterback number two, Shadur Sanders, running back. Shadur Sanders, Shadur Sanders in the shotgun, and it's complete across the midfield stripe and completed. And right now, Jackson State's using their tight end early on in this first quarter. Sanders in the shotgun here, second down and nine. Swing pass out to the right side, out 40, 30, 20, 10, 5, touchdown, Jackson State University, and that is Willie Gaines on the score, the junior from Cocoa Beach, Florida. Especially on the outside edge. 142 yards and two touchdowns last week. Sanders in a lot of trouble, and he's going down at about the 32-yard line. Great defense by the Delta Devils, and on the sack, for Mississippi Valley is number 50, Ronnie Thomas. Big target for Sanders. Back to pass, and it is complete. And it's back to Hooks, who is tackled at about the 25-yard line. In Jackson, Mississippi, so he wants to be able to get these guys tired up front in this first half. Shador Sanders fakes the handoff and gets it back to the outside. And it's caught across the 40 up to about the 44-yard line. So it looks like Jackson is going to pass the football. Here's Sanders back to pass. It's complete to the 45-yard line of Mississippi Valley. Great catch and a lot of traffic there. The fake to Wilkerson, the throw over to the wide receiver. That's going to be the tight end once again for Jackson State University. In this first quarter of play, battle between these two Mississippi schools. Wilkerson, 30, 25, 20, still on his feet. Keeps his footing, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, Jackson State. Excellent run there by Wilkerson. Goal. That'll be a big win for them, but for Jackson, they're trying to get into the end zone. Wilkerson with the big run. Here's the give once again, and he stopped. That's no, a fumble. He did, it's a fumble on the play. Huge break. And the Delta Devils come away with the football as the Jackson State Tigers were trying to go into the end zone. Huge turnover for Jackson State. Three receivers set now for Mississippi Valley. Sanders gets it across the middle to his target. That's going to be Dallas Daniels who gets inside the 40 to about the 36-yard line. 71st meeting between these two teams. Here's Sanders back to pass. It's complete. 30. 25 down to about the 20-yard line of Mississippi Valley. Here's Sanders with the pass, complete to the tight end, tackled at the 11. Sanders out now in the shotgun, man in motion now for Jackson State. Here's a swing pass. It is caught, and it's going to be a touchdown for Jackson State University. Out to J.D. Martin. First down and 10 for Jackson State. Here is the give across the 5, out to the 10. The freshman getting across the 15, 20, 30, 40, midfield. 40, one man to beat, and he's going to take it to the five-yard line, down inside the five at about the three. The freshman from the Valley four-yard line to uh, down to the Valley four-yard line, and here's the throw inside. Touchdown. Touchdown, Jackson State University. And on the catch for JSU is Shane Hooks. Here's Jones back to pass, looking. He is under tremendous pressure. Fumble on the play. And let's see who comes away with it. If you're Valley, you hope you have the ball because if not, Jackson's got the ball inside the 10. Good job there by Jackson State, bringing pressure down the middle, forcing Jones to step up in the pocket and take a big hit as he drops the football. You can see right here, look at the pressure by number 90 coming straight down Main Street. As Jones tried to step up and make a pass, end up dropping the football. So, Jack, again, Mississippi Valley will have to punt the ball away. Hernandez gets one high up in the air. This one will take Jackson back past the 50, 40. 
If you get a shot at the end zone, I say take it if you're the sophomore, but try to get the first down. Here's Sanders looking, getting the ball to his receiver and out of bounds. And once again, as Dallas Daniels, ball at the two yard line. Here is the give. And in, is that a touchdown? Touchdown, Jackson State University. J.D. Martin on the run. 90. One of the things that a lot of people don't know about, didn't know about W.C. Gordon, is he was a huge jazz fan. Oh. Picked off by Jackson State, and that's going to be six more on the board. And you can just see right there, you can see it coming as the linebacker smelt that play, set back in his drop, was able to read the coverage, and also close in on the interception. Huge interception return for a touchdown for Jackson State. That's a touchdown. See right here as Jones drops back, going to his progressions. Linebacker steps right in, right in front of the coverage. I mean, right in front of the route to be able to pick off that interception. Trips to the near side now for Jackson State here. Sanders back to pass. Looking, steps up in the pocket. 35, 40, 45 midfield. And he's down at about the 47-yard line. Down the sideline. Three receivers set. Here's Sanders with the pass, and it's complete. Just a four-receiver set, and this time he comes out to Shane Hooks. And is, they're not going to call a fumble, I believe. Are they going to call this a fumble? Shape to be with the band. <laughs> Absolutely, you got to be in shape for the band. Here's Sanders back to pass, looking. Steps up. Great delivery. Caught it about the 15 yard line. University Tigers knocking on the door once again, 42 7 to score. Sanders now rolling out, looking for an open receiver, and it is caught. And that's going to be a touchdown. Jackson State. Southern, that's going to be a big one for both teams there at the end of October. Here's Sanders back to pass. Looking for the open receiver and it nearly picked up. Did it get picked off? Oh, yeah. yes. They said it was <laughs> intercepted. As you can see right here, he just stands in the pocket, throws it out there. Excellent job out of the defensive back to get his hands up, focus and concentrate on the football. And Coach Prime coming from the other side. The two will meet. Very good friends. Well respected. Respect each other tremendously. You know, the game was very competitive early on in the first half. Give credit to Jackson State. We were able to make those halftime adjustments. Came out and dominated the third quarter on all three levels, offensively, defensively. The special team helped them with field position. And Coach Prime, you know he has an outstanding son and quarterback in Shador Sanders, throwing for over 400 yards with four touchdowns. Unfortunately, he threw an interception late in the game, but he played phenomenal, finding the open targets, taking what he was given, was also hitting guys down the field. Give credit to Jackson State. They rolled in the second half.